Hello, people. How are you? My name's Kev. This is Angling and Anxiety. It's all about the angling. It's about the anxiety. Good morning and welcome back. Let's turn the light back on. Right, we're on our way to go and do some wrecking. The time is 20 to, 20 to 5 in the morning. We're on a mission and I'm determined today I'm going to get a Pollock. If I don't by the end of this video, I'm going to be very sad, but we'll see what happens. Couldn't get myself down the motorway. Left at 3 o'clock this morning. Got a little secret and an ominous guide with me because he doesn't want to be on the videos, which is fair enough. And I've got good old Charlie. So, see how we get on. Fingers crossed. Let's get down there. Right, so we're on a boat. Warming the engine up at a minute, getting some gear on. Big ferries over there. Let's get out in the water. Right, people, we are five miles offshore in a minute. We've got another nine miles to go. Um, Charles will show you the Navionics. We're cruising along at slightly slower knots to try and save the petrol. Um, we've got 50 litres on board, but we don't want to run out when we're 14 miles offshore. So, taking a nice steady cruise. Let's get ourselves to the wreck. Right guys, we are 15 miles offshore. It's a little bit choppy, not too bad. Just setting the rods up. You can't actually see the level of chop, but one thing you can't see either is land. <laughs> um, waypoint arrival. So now we're just gonna sort of see what way we're drifting. So we're having a look. We've sort of stopped here so you can see it's drifting this way. Um, just picking up. We are over 207 foot of water at the moment. But yeah, I'm going to put it down. I'm going to get lead on my water. That's for Rick, as you can see. Um, I'm going to put the water down and get the lead get the lead onto me. Put the water down. I'm all over the gaff. My legs are like jelly. But yeah, I'm going to get this out. I'm going to get my rod sorted. Right, people, we're dropping over. I've had to rest you on the side, so I can't guarantee the camera quality. But Glenn's had a take. No fish landed yet, though. Got a lovely drift coming up now. This is a third drift now, so right, it's on the bottom. One, two, three. Sit on over. One, two, three, four. Rex coming up, boys. A few fish around it at the bottom. Thank you. 
lots of hoodoo right now. Loads of fish. Don't catch one now. Right, we're going to go again, people. We're going to go again. Right, back out again, people. Back out again. Oh, so that. A lot of fish there. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, Kev. Yes, Kev. Go easy now. Yeah, I've got a fish. Go on, boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is strong. I feel it a minute ago. Come up to the surface. There's no of it, Kev. Get some more there. It's got it all in there, now. Just bite it like a dog. Bite it like a dog. Pull it gone, people. Come on, mate, they go. Now, I've done that as a really slow, slow wind. Not that I'm teaching the pros how to do it or anything. Oh, it's come off. Right. It is. Oh, now it's come off. Got it. Keep going, Kev. Come off, man. Must have done. Just give it out. Just give up. No, I've got him. You've got him. Pull it. Pull it. Yes. 
Nice pull it, Pringle. I'm telling you about that, Phil. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's wet. Look at that beauty, people. Right. Happy days, mate. Right in the corner. Beautiful. Happy days, look at that. <laughs> Sorry, we're going to drift again. Right, back out again, people. Oh, I'll go again.
Six drift now, people. Just coming up the wreck now. It's quite choppy out there, but it's not too bad. A lot better when you're still. When you're actually trying to navigate the boat, it's a different story. That again. Just controlling it as I'm dropping it down. Just trying to save any knots. At the bottom. Oh well, one little gear down in it. Guys, you live and learn. So you're right over top of it now, boys. Still there, people. Yeah. First time I've ever tied a lead knot. Right, I'll bring you back. Charles into his first pollock. First ever pollock. I didn't even manage to get my line out in this drift. I had a yeah, snag in the last one. I won't stop leaning, boy, I won't stop leaning. <laughs> like a little pool, look at Yeah. I'm sure Cameron Jones is in this drift. The wheel's gone coming. I'll catch 
Ah scusi la nuova. Ora non conciò. Che conciò. Dove è? Lovely pollock. Oh, fish. Yes, oh. oh, grab all the come over here. Sit. Lovely job. <laughs> Alright, so guys, we've had to cut the video short because my phone died and spirit me being the daft person I am, um, didn't bring his charger wire. I've got a lovely brand new power pack, but no charger wire. We are at the minute about 23 miles off. We've just seen a lovely massive pod of dolphins that we first first off thought was tuna. But to be fair, we had a bad day, have we sure? No. Nope. Not a bad day at all. Look at them. Absolute whoppers. We've done alright. Dinner served, but honest to God, I'll just show you some size comparison. Could you just add that for me, Char? Serious. Serious Pollock. Look at him. So happy days, we're gonna get ourselves back now. Um, sorry about the terrible bit of stopping and starting with a video. Um, next time I will remember to bring my charger wire. We see CJ from uh, YouTube, can't remember what his channel's called. I read his link to the comments, but yeah, go and give him a subscribe, lovely bloke. Um, both fishing the same wrecks, both being polite and whatnot. So happy days. Um, yeah, Kushti, sweet as a nut. We've got dinner, going back to shore now. Kushti. picture of it in a second but yeah brilliant day had a little bit of engine travel on the way back in which was annoying um another bill up my gut it's gone in the marina for a service a diagnose diagnostics plug-in um but yeah we didn't mate it's only gonna get better please believe me it's only gonna get better and i'll get a bee in my bonnet that's it Been losing sleep over these pollock went out the other day complete failure didn't know what I was doing. I had to have someone come show me what to do. Bam, straight on the fish. Took the gamble, went out as far as you could even believe. Honest to God, it was absolutely petrifying on the way out. I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, but yeah, mission complete. It was all worth it in the end. So happy days, Kushti. Roll on shark season. <laughs>